There's no better way to celebrate summer in the land of pleasant living than enjoying the Chesapeake Bay's steamed crabs and ice cold Natty Bow. The two just seem to go hand in hand and now the National Bohemian Beer Company has rolled out its second annual Tabs for Crabs program. Here to tell us more about the program, it's Simo Momoloi. Hello, hello. How are you? I was like, Simo Momoloi. That's right. There yeah, that was, that was very official. I liked Thank it. You. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we're super, super excited for year two of Tabs for Crabs, um, rolling it out this summer and so far so good. Yeah, yeah. it's been going really, really so well. I was surprised to find out that this is the second annual because I heard so much about it yes. last year. It was yeah. quite a success. Yeah, we, I mean, you put two things together that people love as much as beer and crabs and, yeah. you know, taking care of the bay and it's just, you know, it's a really easy way for people to get involved in, Around a, in a great cause. Around these parts, it's not a tough sell. So, That's right. for people who are unfamiliar, what yes. exactly is Tabs for Crabs? So, Tabs for Crabs uh, is a program where we take the tab on all the Natty Bow cans that we have uh, and turn them red and etch them with a little crab. It's very mm -hmm. cute. It uh, very cute. And each tab that we collect back is 10 cents up to $10,000 that we donate to the Chesapeake Bay Foundation uh, so that they can still advocate for, um, you know, the water uh, conservation, that sort of thing in the Chesapeake Bay. So they just save these tabs and then what do they do with them? So we convert the donation over. So it was, uh, it was an idea that Mr. Bo had about a year or two ago. But yeah, we, we basically tie those to the donation so that that way the more tabs we collect up to $10,000, we get to donate that to the Chesapeake Bay Foundation. And so how many did you collect last year? So we weren't really sure what to expect last year. It was yeah. the first year out, you know, just trying to figure out what the, what the market would be like for it. And uh, sure enough, we collected 85,000 tabs last year. 85,000? Yeah, imagine like year. 10 or 15 times as much as what we have on the table oh here today. <laughs> yeah, it was, uh, it was pretty intense. So uh, you expect probably more than that this year? Yeah, I, I think I should probably start counting them yeah. now, yeah. Um, but yeah, it's been, it's been a really, really great program and, and um, people can collect the tabs either at home uh, or they can collect them at their favorite bar or restaurant. That's what I was gonna ask. Yeah. So you can form a team, so I don't yes. just have to I mean, this would be a problem if I was going oh, yeah, through yeah, this yeah. much beer. That's right. So I can get a team at like my favorite watering hole yes. and we can you know, put yes, it together in a yeah. bucket. Uh, actually, last year, one of the great things about, uh, you know, the first time we went through it was that a lot of folks wrote handwritten notes and actually did some matching donations, things like that. Uh, so they turn in their whole collection and there's, there's a little bit of a story that goes along with each one. So, yeah. you know, in the true fashion of, uh, you know, of picking crabs around the table with your family and everything, stories are the best part. So, you they know. They really are. Yeah. They yeah, really are. Sure. Okay, so this is the second annual. It's starting now. Before you wrap up, I yes. want to hear about the newest beer that you've released in oh, 30 yes, years. Oh, yes, yes. Yeah, this is from the vault from Mr. Bo here. Um, it's our first new beer in uh, over 30 years. It's the Crab Shack Shandy. So, obviously, we're all about the crabs right now. Yeah. So, uh, it's a lemon citrus shandy. Uh, it's delicious. Goes really, really well with crabs. Doesn't taste like crab spice because we wanted it to pair well with crabs. Okay. So, um, it's still available now, although I will say, we just had our last production. So it's only it summertime. Yeah, it's only in the summertime. So uh, we'll be uh, looking for some good weather Perfect. this Say weekend. Say it again. It's the... Crab Shack Shandy. That's fun yeah. to say. And a tongue twister. Every couple That's of right. those, you won't be able to say it. Like a day on the bay. <laughs> it's a Chesapeake way to celebrate summertime. Good food, great friends. All about good stuff. Got it. Okay, so you've got this. You've got this. How long is this going for? This is going to be going all the way through October 1st. We're trying to, to gather them all up. We'll Good. do a big weigh-in there at the um, uh, Annapolis headquarters for the Chesapeake Bay Foundation. Mm -hmm. And uh, we'll, we'll announce the total via our social media. Okay, and I, oh, I'm, oh my goodness, I forgot about no, this. No, no, it's great. We actually worked with a local company here uh, in Baltimore yeah. called Balta Virtual uh, to develop these augmented reality cool. coasters. Yeah, so we have a crab Look that actually that. pops up out of the uh, tab that's there, <laughs> or out of the coaster that's there, and uh, he'll join you for a drink or two. I think that's the first time I thought a crab was cute. That's right, yeah. He's typically not too cute. He's a good looking Thank guy. Thank you so much. That's <laughs> fun. We'll be using that when we get these tabs for crabs. Fantastic. Appreciate you being yeah. here, and we'll be right back with more Midday Maryland right after this. Thank Stay you. tuned.